Let's talk baby must-haves. never seen a video from me before my name's Maddie I have a three month old and a three year old and I like to keep things pretty minimal and natural I have another video about all the things that I think are unnecessary for babies children and babies are pretty simple as far as their needs go really what they need is your presence and attention and care everything else is kind of extra that being said this is the top 10-ish things that have added the most value for me in the last three years of parenting for two kids now and so I want to share them with you. I have a huge pile of all my favorite baby stuff sitting here. Let's get into this list. Okay, number one on the list is, you've probably seen this before, it's the Snuggle Me Organic. It is a baby co-sleeper, I don't think they actually call it that, they call it a lounger but it has an inner like cushiony pillow um, and what it's meant to do is kind of mimic being held. So both my babies have really loved this thing and then it comes with this, you can buy lots of different colors and whatever of the cover. It's just a super soft, great little baby lounger co-sleeper and you can put it in your bed, that's what we do. I guess I should preface this in saying, um, this is not me telling you this is what you should do. This is just what I did or we did and worked for us. I find that having them in bed with me in the co-sleeper helps um, everyone get more sleep. And then it makes breastfeeding easier for me. It was such an essential. I feel like it tops the list as the most essential item. Okay, next on my list. This is gonna be weird. Maybe I should save this to the end. I don't know, this breast milk and sleep, the two most important things in my mind for my babies. So having the support you need to make sure breastfeeding is going well and um, that baby's latch is correct and not painful. For me, it was like for six months of breastfeeding with my daughter was just really challenging and having the support around you to make that easier. It's kind of a good feeling to just know you can go anywhere and always have everything your baby needs with you. So yeah, for me, breastfeeding and having the support to breastfeed was huge. If you are a new mom and you're struggling with breastfeeding or you're pregnant and you're making a list of everything that you're gonna need for your baby, really just being prepared for your postpartum period and that obviously including breastfeeding support would be my number one recommendation for getting ready to have a baby is just being prepared that it's gonna be tough to breastfeed and you're gonna need help. And it's a skill, not something that just comes natural, it's actually a skill you have to learn. So having those professionals around you to teach you that skill, there you go, that's my rant on that. Okay, number three is sleepers. The sleepers with the zips are definitely the essential. Anyway, so yeah, zipper sleepers, I like these organic ones. These are from Amazon, I think. They're called Touch by Nature. I also like the Bird's Bees ones and Hannah Anderson ones. Those are both really cozy too. Next on the list is cloth diapers. I want to make a whole nother video about cloth diapers. That's how much I love cloth diapers. I have used every cloth diaper brand under the sun. And my two very favorite from newborn all the way to aged toddler potty trained and all that. The Grovia, the butter line, and the Bum Genius all-in-one diapers with the snaps. Okay, so the nice thing about these is that you can stuff them with the inserts that come with them. That's fine. So they come with inserts like this. It's like, this is probably for a smaller baby. This is for like a bigger baby with more pee. Or this is my favorite. You can just buy a huge pack of these free folds like on Amazon. These are just a bunch of organic pre-folds and they are really absorbent. They're also really soft. I don't know, they just fit well without being too bulky. Um, yeah, so these are great. Another thing that's a must have with these are just cloth wipes. If you're cloth diapering, like you might as well just do the cloth wipe thing too. You just wipe them, throw a whole cloth diaper, just like a disposable, you stick the wipe in here and throw it in the pail and throw the whole thing in the wash. Once you have them washed and in the drawer, Kind of the same as using disposables. I have a lot to say about cloth diapers, but I'll leave it at that. Those are my two favorite brands, the Grovia Butter 
ones might even be better. They're just really soft and snuggly for a newborn baby. It's just so fun to snuggle them. They're just softer, so. Are you hungry? Okay, next on the list is swaddles. These are just great to have for all types of uses. We have just a bunch. She's come in handy for all types of things with babies and even toddlers from just like a light little cover if they're in the stroller to um, wiping up all the myriad of things that you need to wipe up when you have babies or just laying it down to change them on. If they get softer every time you wash them, they are definitely an essential. Okay, next on the list, capsule wardrobe. I talked about this in one of my Insta stories, so I'll just show you a clip of that. But we have little capsule wardrobes set up for both of the kids and that just makes dressing them so much simpler. When they grow out of something, I just replace that thing in their new size and I find it just simplifies the whole process of both buying clothes and dressing children in clothes. Next is this. This thing gets used every single day. I think it's a 12 ounce hydro flask. It has a straw. This comes with us everywhere. It fits in the car seat. It fits in the stroller. Um, yikes, it's a little dirty. As soon as they're able to drink out of straws, this thing is really handy. Let's see, along those same lines, another thing that gets used every day. Okay, these are not that cute, but these are called Keen. Another shoe that's kind of like this are native baby shoes. Those or these, some kind of shoe that can go in water and out of water. Also, it doesn't have laces so that your toddler can put them on by themselves. Is a big deal. I don't know. Are they sandals? Are they shoes? I don't know. Yeah, these are just great. Love those. All right, next on the list is the Ergo Baby. I have had every baby carrier that you can possibly imagine. I've tried the Solly Wrap, the Moby Wrap, the Baby Catan. I even had one of those ring slings that you always see on Instagram. You know what I'm talking about. The rings, the linen ring sling. They're all fine. It's just that this is so much better. For both kids, I find that my back hurts the least wearing this one. I think this is an older version, but um, of the 360, there's probably a better one now. But this thing has served us very well. It's washable, it's durable, it fits like a lot of the baby wraps. My husband and I would have to have different sizes, so you'd have to have like more than one. This thing is just like really quick to adjust if like he's been wearing it and then I'm gonna wear it. It's really, really quick to put on. It's easy to figure out. It has another little feature that I like, which is this, which you might be thinking, what the heck is that? It is to protect, like once they fall asleep, it's to protect their like face from the sun or the elements, which is actually great because my kids nap in this all the time. So that thing I could not live without. Let's see what else is in my beach bag. Let me tell you something. Finding a favorite baby sunscreen took me almost three years. But this one from All Good, a tinted sunscreen butter. It's water resistant, SPF 50, reef friendly, all nap. If you're into leaving beeswax out. This particular one is vegan, but I think there is beeswax in some of their products. Having the tinted one just looks less crazy. And truthfully, I, we don't wear sunscreen enough, but this is my favorite one and I try to put it on as much as I can. Vitamins. I don't think I started her on vitamins other than DHA until she was done breastfeeding, which was not even that long ago. But this is mine and her favorite multivitamin. It's from My Kind Organics. No weird ingredients, all whole food, real vitamin blend. Um, soy, dairy, gluten-free, nut-free. She's also taken the um, Mary Ruth's multi, liquid multi. She likes that one too, but this one is her favorite and I actually am really impressed with the ingredients in this one too. And a first aid kit. We just have like some natural coconut oil band-aids, which I will link to because those, it's really hard to find a good band-aid. This Wild Thera Cuts and Scrapes Balm. We use this all the time. I think I made a thing about this on my Insta stories too, everything that's in here. So if you wanna see the rest of everything in here, you can check it out there. Otherwise, I won't bore you with that. But first aid kit has been essential for us with a toddler that's just curious and running around. And 
you know, injuries are kind of bound to happen. The first aid kit comes in super handy. The last couple things are huge and not in here, but it's a double stroller jogger by Mountain Buggy. If you live somewhere where you wanna go hiking or like drive it in the sand like we do, it can actually handle that and doesn't ruin the wheels. It's been essential to have a rocker, like a, chair, a rocker chair or a swing. In our case, we have like an outdoor swing that we recommend. He loves to take naps in there with Kyle. With Mallory, we had like a rocking chair, but now in the house we live in, we just prefer to be outside. So lastly, a someplace that's safe where your baby can sit, so that you can like make dinner, brush your hair, use the bathroom. The one that we have is from Charlie Crane. It gets a ton of use. He seems to like it enough. That thing seems to do the job if you want. You can kind of like gently rock them. He doesn't really sleep in it, but he does stay happy just like looking around. It's lightweight, you can take it to the beach, like we do, <laughs> or not. <laughs> but yeah, you guys, I think that's gonna do it for my baby must-haves. Thanks for watching this video.